Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is doing well today. Today we're gonna to be talking about summer clothing and some outfit ideas. I'm kind of just gonna be going over some of my clothing essentials for summer and also giving you some outfit ideas that kind of revolve around my personal style as well as the academia aesthetic and the coquette aesthetic. Well, you guys know I kind of like to base things off of my personal style while also adding these like aesthetic elements into them. So I find summer to be like the worst season in terms of dressing myself uh, I tend to um, what is it rely on like layering my clothes to make like a really cute and good-looking outfit um, but with summer I can barely do that because I live in Texas and it's been like a hundred degrees the past few days and it's been freaking awful I'm gonna be giving you some outfit ideas that you can realistically wear in the summer without just like dying of heat so I hope this is like helpful to some people this isn't gonna be like my most like creative like eccentric fashion video like i just want to give some like really like wearable outfit ideas because personally that's what i need in my life i made a list of some things that i think you guys will like and i'll also give you some outfit ideas at the end so i hope you guys enjoy today's video and let's get into the clothing essentials so i'm going to start with some tops now i found this quadric category to be like the hardest <laughs> to find inspiration for but one of the first things that i wanted to mention is umpire waist tops i currently just love these i've been talking about them in my last few videos so i feel like i'm being repetitive but but I think they are just so cute to throw on during the spring and summer and it just looks like very vintage and cute and it kind of has that Y2K feel while also pulling inspiration from like Regency core and stuff like that. Um, and these ones are from Brandy Melville. I like them because they're pretty lightweight so I actually can wear them in the summer without it being too hot. I also like umpire waist tank tops such as this one which is from Yes Style and I feel like this is also just a really easy to throw on thing when it's like really hot and I can't even bother to wear like a full sleeve or anything. Just throw on like a little cute girly tank top with like a skirt or something and that kind of makes a cute outfit. My next suggestion is milkmaid tops is kind of what I'm calling this. So any top that has just like a vintage flowy kind of feel. Um, I recommend looking for tops like this or like the last top that I mentioned. Um, you can go on eBay and just search milkmaid top and like the cutest like vintage tops will come up. Just do that thank me later um i always find really cute stuff on there so i definitely recommend looking on there um but i believe this one i got on thread up um, this is kind of a boring suggestion but lace tank tops have been a lifesaver for me lately so just anything like this with like a little lace trim i think they're really good to layer underneath things so i'm wearing this green one today and then i like to layer them underneath to have the lace peeking through or just wear it like on its own like sometimes it's just like so hot i can't even be bothered um they're also good for like sleeping in but anyway so they have multi-purpose good for layering good for wearing on its own and it just has like a very cute like coquette feel um i also have this one which is from amazon but honestly like this one's thrifted this one's thrifted you can find a ton of tops like this in like a tank top section of a goodwill or like any kind of charity shop like that my last suggestion is any kind of vest that isn't a sweater vest so i really love this one because it's super lightweight um i have a couple other vests that i'll include in the outfits later on but i think this is a really cute thing for the academia aesthetic and then you can either just like wear honestly i could wear this on its own with like a little like scarf um, like a really lightweight scarf and like a skirt or some shorts or something and i feel like that would be really cute um, or i could layer it over like a milkmaid top or something like that i'll show some examples later on but i really think getting a good vest that isn't like a really thick sweater vest is a good idea so i have a few skirts and shorts options for the summer my first one is a corduroy skirt uh, this one is from h and i just think it's a really just i really just like corduroy right now honestly and i think it looks really cute in skirt or shorts form like corduroy shorts would be super cute i actually really need to find some of those at the thrift store um but again i like the brown color i feel like it's like a warm color that would be good for summer and yeah i'm just really into that right now the other thing that i've also been recently into is a khaki skirt um you can find a lot of these at the thrift store but i got mine from brandy melville and again i think it's a cute like summer look especially like this little like mini skirt vibe when it's like low waisted it kind of has that like y2k summer feel so it definitely is kind of nostalgic for me my other suggestion is floral skirts um i mentioned these in one of my last videos i have this little floral skirt from brandy melville it's just super lightweight super cute as well as this brown skirt and these are nice because a lot of times in the summer i 
like want to like not you know die of heat but i also want to be just like a little bit more covered so i'm always reaching for these in the summertime i think cargo shorts i'm wearing some right now i'll have to insert a video or something are really cute for the coquette slash academia summer aesthetic um i just think they're really easy to throw on and they're super duper comfortable and i love that and i've kind of been into like the low-waisted ones um these are from H&M, I'll link them down below. If you're more into like the high-waisted pant short look, I would definitely recommend getting some paper bag shorts. These are a denim black paper bag short from uh, Princess Polly. I like these because they're a little bit longer of a short. Um, it's kind of like mid-thigh if I don't roll them up all the way. And yeah, these are just really good go-to short for me as well. Like I said, being comfortable is like one of the most important parts of my summer aesthetic. So I really like these kind of like linen material shorts from Aerie. And they're just super duper comfortable. I'm always reaching for them when I want to be comfortable, but also like kind of cute and like a little bit dressed up you know because um, it has like this kind of um flare at the bottom and they're just really nice and comfortable and i definitely recommend getting a pair of shorts like this moving on to dresses i have a few just kind of like general suggestions for this so any kind of white sundress you know depending on what you're into i feel like this is something you can kind of personalize if you want something like longer and like more flowy then you can do that or something with like a longer like puff sleeve or something would be really cute but for me this one here from Brandy Melville has been like saving my life this summer because it's super lightweight and it's like a tank top so I can actually wear it in the summer without getting too hot. And if I'm like going in somewhere, I'll just throw like a little cardigan or like something like this over on top. Next is a floral dress or like any kind of floral sundress. So this is one just from YesStyle, super like simple silhouette. It kind of has a bit of an umpire waist. So I love that. It's really my vibe lately um, and a little tie front. but. I don't know i just like things that are like summery but then have like darker colors because it still kind of aligns with my my aesthetic but i can also you know still wear it in the summer and again this is just kind of random but like another sundress like how cute would this be just like going to like a little like strawberry patch and picking strawberries and then coming home and making like a strawberry shortcake or something i should definitely do that this summer this one is super comfortable it is also from yes style okay i had to take off my um my shirt because it's really hot in here i have to turn the air conditioner off so that you guys can hear me but my other dress suggestion is any kind of long dress um i like this one because it has that little polka dot print um i wore this in one of my recent videos and it's vintage from the 90s it was my mom's anything that's like a little bit longer again like if i'm feeling like i want to cover more skin but i also want to like wear a flowy dress and feel like i'm in a summer mood then this is what i gravitate toward i forgot to mention this like with the other tops but whatever we're being casual here so the other thing is just like a cute button up um that's like very lightweight to the one i was just wearing which is this one i've just had it forever um these are just great to throw on like over like a tank top like this or just like to the beach as a beach cover up is also really cute and then kind of along the same lines just a really small like cardigan this one is only like a three quarter length sleeve so i could even wear it out like maybe at nighttime. but this is more so like if i'm going i don't know out to dinner and i want to wear like a cute sundress like that but i also get really cold easily if i'm like inside somewhere so i always want to bring like a little something to have and like this is just something that's nice just like throw on so just like little cute like neutral colored cardigans i feel like are just nice to have if you're going inside somewhere so that's just kind of like some a good essentials list to go off of but i also want to show you some like outfit ideas just to kind of pull inspiration from on how to style stuff like this first outfit is the one that i'm already wearing but do you guys know what this reminds me of like so much is well two things so the first thing it reminds me of is like something bella swan would wear like in the summer you know like this is like i feel like if this was pants and like a longer sleeve shirt this would like definitely be a bella swan outfit but i feel like this is like the summer version of like bella swan core which is definitely my vibe um so i just have the cargo shorts on that i was talking about a little lace cami with a lightweight button up over on top and then just if i was going out i would just add a little casual canvas bag onto the outfit and again this is really nice because if i'm really hot i could just take off the overshirt and then just wear the tank top and the shorts with the canvas bag and i feel like it's just really casual simple but like still just like very cute and a good like go-to outfit if you just don't know what to wear the other thing that this reminds me of which i actually have never seen because it scares me which is jurassic park but i feel like this is like something like one of the girls in jurassic park would wear 
right? Okay, next outfit. I feel like this would be a good like summer date night outfit. Um, so I'm wearing that floral dress that I mentioned before. And then I just have this little casual um, shoulder bag to throw on. I've been wearing this cameo necklace because I feel like it incorporates that kind of like dark academia side of my style, but also makes it wearable for summer because it's just a necklace, you know, and doesn't add that much heat. Though sometimes it's like so hot that I'm like, I can't even wear a necklace, you know, like I just can't even be bothered to have something on my neck. And then if I was like going inside somewhere, I would totally just add this little cardigan on top. Um, so that's what it looks like with the cardigan on top. Just a cute like little layer to add without adding too much, but still making it wearable for summer. So yeah, that's basically the whole outfit. Let's move on to the next one. Next outfit is one of my favorites and really just like a go-to casual outfit when I'm still trying to look cute. So I'm wearing these like really lightweight high-waisted shorts from Aerie. And then I have this Brandy Melville top and I layered a lace tank top underneath. Um, and then I just have this pearl necklace from Every Jewels. I do have a discount code, so I'll put it down below with the link to the necklace. In the summer and spring and fall and winter and basically all year round, I, if I want to be cool and casual looking, I just throw on that tote bag. Um, this is one, I don't know if I mentioned, but it's from a local apple orchard in Indiana. So kind of random, but it's one of my favorites. Um, for shoes, I've just wearing, been wearing these like basic white sandals that I've literally had forever. I honestly need to get some new summer shoes because these ones are like about ready to fall apart but yeah but yeah i feel like this is the like epitome of my summer style it's very coquette but also kind of like academia aesthetic and yeah this one is just a good go-to for me okay this next outfit is a little bit more dressed up but i love it because it definitely has like a dark academia feel to it so i feel like this would be a good outfit for like a day at the art museum like somewhere spent inside because it is layered up a little bit um i mean i feel like if you lived in like a normal place that wasn't 100 degrees outside then you would be able to wear something like this but for me i could not wear this outside like i'm actually hot with it in my room without the air conditioner so i know i would struggle but you know somewhere inside would be cute so i'm wearing this corduroy skirt that i mentioned before the vest layered over this little like milkmaid blouse um, my bag is from Echo Susie Vintage. I do have a discount code with them as well, so I'll put it down below with the link to the bag. Something I've been really into lately is train hats or newspaper boy hats, whatever you want to call them. I feel like this is a cute accessory to add and also, you know, shades my face from the sun because I do get sunburned a lot during the summer. Um, and I really want to get another one of these that's like a beige color. Um, I saw one from Urban Outfitters. I don't want to get it there, but I did see one and I was like, I definitely need to pick something up like that. For shoes, I'd probably just wear my Mary Janes with this outfit. It's a good go-to. They never fail me. Um, but yeah, that is basically the whole outfit. Let's move on to the next one. The okay, next outfit, this is kind of how I would style that khaki sh um, skirt. I was going to say shirt. It's a skirt. Um, so this is kind of how I would style it just with like I feel like it can go with a lot of different tops because it's a good neutral, but I like this kind of like brown and khaki aesthetic. This also kind of gives me like a Rory Gilmore, Bella Swan type vibe. I mean, she probably wouldn't wear a skirt like this, but you know what I mean. It has that like very like, like grunge coquette, I guess I would say. I went ahead and paired this cameo necklace with it and this bag, which is from Brady Melville. It's like a good corduroy messenger bag. I love it. Um, okay, when I ordered this top, I'll link it down below, but when I ordered it, I did not know it had a hood what do we think of the hood i would never wear like this i mean probably not i don't know it's like kind of a vibe i yeah I, I wouldn't wear it like this but that's very interesting that it has a hood right and i don't mind the way it looks from the back either it's kind of it's kind of cute I, I wouldn't wear it up but i think it's like it's an interesting detail i will say another cute shoe option for an outfit like this a little bit more grunge tomboy would be some Doc Martens. These are the 1461 Bex Smooth Other Oxford Shoe. Um, but yeah, that is basically the whole outfit. Let's move on to the next one. Okay, I think I was right. This is like the perfect outfit for going strawberry picking. I'm definitely gonna have to schedule a strawberry picking trip in the near future. Um, so if you see me on Instagram in a strawberry field, this is where the idea originated. But this is that green dress that I mentioned before. Again, I'm just really into like the umpire waist. I feel like it's super flattering and it's just like very flowy and comfortable as well um i just paired the the good old canvas bag for my jewelry i kind of layered up here so i both of these necklaces are from every jewels so i have the one the little letter necklace and the um 
just like this little heart pendant necklace. But yeah, any flowy sundress like this is a must have for summer and obviously you can find them a ton of different places. Like literally any store you go to, I feel like has dresses like this right now. Um, but obviously you can still find stuff like this at the thrift store as well. So yeah, next outfit is very like coquette aesthetic, I feel like. So I have this floral skirt. Also, I wore this outfit in my last video. So if you recognize it, hi. We're re-wearing it for this video. But I have this floral skirt from Brandy Melville. This top is from Amazon. Again, I just love these like little lacy tops, um, like tank tops just to pair with different outfits. And I feel like it's just a really easy go-to for me, especially when it's like super hot. I can't even, you know, be bothered to wear like a quarter length sleeve or anything like that. Um, same jewelry I had on in the last outfit. And then look at this little bag that I thrifted. So freaking cute. I call it like my little like grandma tote. Like I got it from the thrift store for $4 and I think it was like handmade by someone because it has no tag and it definitely looks handmade by the stitching. And I just absolutely love it. I will cherish it forever. Oh, this is giving me like coastal coastal girls summer italian dreams summer outfit that was a lot of words to put into one aesthetic but i think you guys understand what i'm going for here okay last outfit for today's video again this is kind of one of those more like comfortable casual options so i'm wearing these paper bag shorts that i showed earlier and this blue lacy tank top and then this like huge oversized um, button up shirt. I love just like throwing this on when I'm wearing an outfit like this, but I'm like, I just want to have something to like cover me. It's like a little like safety blanket, you know? Um, this bag from Brady Melville. Again, this is like just one of those like twilight core. It's like summer, it's like summer twilight core, which I feel like is totally my vibe. Um, but yeah, anyways, just something that's like very casual. Um, I love being comfortable in the summer. Like if it's, if it's too much, if it's like too many layers or just like too many like it's too tight or anything like that i just like can't deal with it so hopefully this video brought you guys some inspiration for your own wardrobe on what to wear this summer if you have a style like mine i don't know i'm assuming you do if you watch my videos but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed today's video make sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel comment down below tell me your favorite outfit and tell me what you guys are wearing this summer because i need some more ideas follow me on tiktok Instagram, Pinterest, all that will be linked down below. But I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day or night whenever you're watching this and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Yeah.